fucking god, time for a new vlog on this luxurious, luxurious day! Today is awesome and sexy weather, it is springtime in the area of Nightmare RH, and it is very awesome and awesome and awesome, sexy time! No, it also is very sexy time, is when you log on to fucking RuneScape, and you get a Dungeoneering task. That is even more sexier than anything, well, just picture my ball sack with no hair and it. it's, it's floating around. Not to mention right now I'm kind of freeballing it. It was, it was pretty goddamn beautiful out today. I said to myself, ah, fuck it, I don't like, that's it. I mean, there's really no point of wearing boxer shorts. You're gonna have the nice, you know, breeze up in your ball sack area, and of course you don't have a ball sack, well, your vagina can always have a nice breeze as well. Anyways, last night we did some shit on RuneScape 2007. We um, basically made some good money and shit. The Bank of Nightmare RH is uh, kinda, kinda growing a little bit. <laughs> I'm kinda, kinda happy again. Oh, there is a god, and he's rewarding me with some GP on 2007, 2007 of the RuneScapians. Uh, yeah, that's basically pretty much about it. Otherwise, last night uploaded, uh, basically, it's, uh, I went to next. And, you know, the worst possible fucking thing that can happen to RuneScapian is you don't die fighting a boss. You just can't fucking kill the bitch. I mean, <laughs> it's, um, it's, uh, easy as that. I mean, it, it basically got down to the fucking simple fact of the matter that Jagex has made next a little more difficult. And during each phase that you face next, it really is not a fucking, you know, it's, it actually takes a little strategy. And if you fuck it up, well, you're not going to kill her. Plain and simple. And she's going to use Soul Split and fucking keep healing like a bitch. Which pretty much fucking sucks. Anyways, besides that, i um, going to be uploading a new, uh, well, but I already did upload a new RuneScape video today. Basically made a video talking about ways not to make money or trying to avoid ways of making money. Kind of interesting because I've always made money making guides. However, I wanted to make a video basically saying this way to make money is bad. It's bad. Bad in Chinatown. And of course, later tonight we'll be uploading a new video as well, plus a new, um, uh, well, what I'm basically going to do is make a playlist. I'm going to make a playlist for my vlogs that are, well, this is a vlog. Going to be basically making a playlist for videos that uh, would have been on the channel Nightmare H on RS. And also going to be making a playlist for uh, videos that would have been on the channel The Nightmare RH. So it stays a little more organized. Also going to be making a playlist for Elder Scrolls type videos as well. Um, so otherwise, uh, yeah, I mean, that's, that's basically pretty much what's, uh, happening in my ball sack today for happy, happy, joy, joy bullshit, and, uh, my ball. Alright, so anyways, today we're going to be talking about how much G GP have you basically made on the game RuneScape. Now, this question can be taken two or one ways. One, when you ask someone how much GP have they made on this game, they tell you their bank value. Now, it's a little different because what your bank is worth is different than what you actually made on this fucking game. And I really wish that the calculator of the wealth that I bought from the goddamn gay ass Solomon store pretty much would have told me how much GP I have made on RuneScape. I can give two let's fucking shit about what my entire bank is really worth because one, I made a video proving that is inaccurate because if you have untradeable um, items or if you have fucking um, items that are degraded, they come up a hell of a lot more than what they're actually fucking worth. So, keeping that basically in mind, it, I, I kind of wish Jagex had basically made something that tells you how much GP have you physically made on this fucking game. Now, if you say to yourself how much GP have you made, that basically eliminates staking. Because staking, I'm sorry, but it's not its not truly money-making on this fucking game. I, I mean, yeah, I staked a bill, I've staked fucking... <laughs> I've staked a fair share of fucking money, and I've also lo lost a lot of fucking money through staking as well. However, it's really not money-making. Because, I mean, you're putting up money to really gamble. 
money making, you're not fucking gambling anything. I mean, money making takes time and it takes fucking effort and a little hard work. Staking, you can fucking stake a bill and you're either gonna, you know, win or you're either gonna blow up your fucking house. <laughs> so, I mean, it's really not money making. Now, investments, that's actually a really good one as well. Investments, it is money making, but at the same time, you physically did not make the fucking money. It's just, it's investments that go up over time. My fucking red party hat is like at 2.2, 2.3 bill. It, it's pretty goddamn incredible, or it might, it might, might be 2.1, I don't fucking know. Regardless, I paid 102, well actually, I paid 144 mil for my part, my purple party hat back in 2008, then party hats crashed, and in 2000, early 2009, I want to say, I pretty much paid 101 mil for my red party hat. And then 2010, everything started bubba 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 You know, everything slowly started rising. My uh, third age, I remember paying like 57 mil ish for, for my fucking third age robe. Now it's something like over 100 mil. Um, I ended up paying like uh, 30 something mil for my robe bottom. Now it's like, I think, near 70 or something. Uh, my third age plate body, I paid like uh, 100 mil. Now it's like fucking, I think like 250, 300. My plate legs I paid for like 112, I think. Now they're, they're, they're in the 200s, I think. Uh, paid 75 mil for my kite shield third age. I think it's over 100 mil or something like that. So, technically, my bank value increase. And yeah, I am richer on this game because of investments. But that's not the physical aspect. That's not something you physically fucking made. I made 125 mil from goddamn Divination. I made, um, I, th I think it was like, I, I can't figure it out, right? I think I made 70 or 80 mil from 99 Crafting. Uh, from 99 Smithing, I think I made like 60 mil or something. I, I can't fucking remember. Um, or it might have been less because I sold the gold bars before. It's like, it's, I, I don't really fucking know. Anyways, the, the amount of money I've made on this game, not to mention fletching, I have 136 million fletching EXP. I have made well fucking over, I'd say probably 200 and something million so far from uh, fletching. So you really calculate all those numbers and just, you know, a broad estimate, if I really think about it, uh, out of all the skills that I basically earn money, not to mention God Wars drops as well. I mean, I, I have been lucky in the past couple months getting God Wars items. Uh, but then again, I don't PVM that much. So you figure maybe I've gotten like 50, 60 mil in God War items. Uh, then you add it to, you know, all my other, you know, 99s that I got. Not to mention fishing, I made a shit ton. I made like 65, 70 mil from fishing. So you add all those fucking numbers up. Probably most likely made, I'd say, give or take around... 500 million GP, like physically made, maybe a little more, maybe a little less, but it's actually pretty insane that, um, you know, my bank is valued at like 4.1, 4.2 billion, and uh, it just goes to show you that physically making money on this game is a lot different than having investments and shit like that. A friend of mine, um, he's in the same boat because his bank value little wealth calculator has his bank being at like 10 bill because he has all, you know, like fucking damage and, un, you know, un unused armor. However, in actuality, his bank is like 1.5 bill. But he earned his bank through uh, PVM. So there's, there's a fucking difference. You know, I mean, some people on this game can legitimately say, like my friend, um, I made 1.5 bill. However, some people, you know, their bank is uh, 10, 20 bill. Did they seriously make that money or did they just go staking? You know what I'm saying? There's, there's, or they could have just been scamming fucking assholes, but it really depends. So the question really is to you guys, how much GP have you really fucking made on this game? It actually blows your mind away when you sit down and actually think about it. Because when I think that my bank is worth over four bill, but in actuality I probably only made, like physically made, I would probably most likely say like over 500 mil, maybe like maybe close to 600 mil. 
kind of really blows the balls off my body. Alright guys, but otherwise, basically like I said, uh, tonight, uh, expect more videos straight from the poop shoot of my, uh, awesome and sexy bum onto YouTube. Not to mention I'll probably be on RuneScape 2007 uh, a little more tonight, gonna be making a little more fucking money and shit. But otherwise, right now, I'll go to my happy asshole email address where you guys can send me shit. Ask Nightmare, check out who.com, do not drink to me, do not drink to many you who's because if you do well, then you get really fucked up. And you won't be able to play RuneScape because you'll be on the toilet shitting out all the you who's you drank. Ah, first, Hoopa Hoopa question. Woo! Dear Nightmare, I was wondering if you're going to be reopening your P.O. box anytime soon so you can actually receive fan, fan mail and maybe some packages as well. From A Hole Master. I guess that's your RuneScape username. <laughs> I have a broad feeling that, uh, well, your username may get reported and uh, your account may go bye-bye. <laughs> That's only a strong instinct straight from my bum. However, I, will I be reopening my P.O. Box? I actually put some thought into it, and I actually do want to do some fan letter type videos and shit. So um, it, it, it's probably going to be in the near future. When I say the near future, I don't mean this week or this weekend because I'm going to be kind of busy, sadly. Mm. However, you know, I mean, it's, it, it can very well fucking happen. But, um, otherwise, guys, let me know some nasty dirty little comments. How much money do you think you have made on this fucking game? Like, physically made. Otherwise, if you enjoy this vlog, please thumbs it up, and I'll see you motherfuckers later. Bye!